The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. Representing the Lucha Dragons from Mexico City, weighing in at 198 pounds, C. The masked marvel's on his way to the ring and looking to fly. Look at Sin Cara's feet. They barely touched the ground when he walked, Cole. He's a freak of nature. Don't be surprised if your jaw hits the floor at any point during this one. These competitors are absolutely unbelievable. And approaching the ring from Chroma City, Madman Bruce Green. Oh boy, we're in for a treat tonight. Both of these superstars look geared up and ready to go. We're finally going to see which one of these two is the superior competitor. And we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. Controlling the head. Full control. He's simply reminding him that he's here. You know, Cole, Sid Cara could end this match with any move at any moment. He's really that good. But it's his top rope senton that has proven to be most impactful. Ow! Ooh. The quick reversal there by Sid Cara. After him. Here's the cover. One. And it's up. He got the shoulder up. to avoid that. Just making his presence felt there. We're looking at complete domination here. You're right, Kang. We've seen Sin Cara put opponents away with a series of different moves. But it seems like the Senton bomb is the move he goes to most. The one he really trusts in big situations. Yeah, and just watching Sin Cara glide through the air and route to landing the Senton, that's a thing of beauty. We're seeing, now that's how you make a statement. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. I'm not sure I can watch this. Sin Cara has gained the upper hand. You don't want to get caught outside the ring for too long. What happened to you? You used to love being outside the ring. It's no wonder Sin Cara is as graceful in the ring as he is. He's been competing ever since he was 15 years old. And since that time, he's battled all over the globe, becoming one of the most well-known international luchadors of all time. Makes the cover. 
and he breaks the cover, forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. Boy, I'm really impressed with the heart of Sin Cara. This guy's a true warrior. He may be in the best physical. What a counter that was. And he dodges that one. Cole, what's he got in mind? Sin Cara has been a global icon for years. But it really wasn't until the night after WrestleMania 27 that WWE fans got a good glimpse at the international sensation. Since that time, Sin Cara has proved his worth against the likes of Alberto Del Rio, The Miz, and Sheamus. Yeah, those certainly were all worthy opponents. But I think my all-time favorite Sin Cara opponent was Sin Cara. That's right, Michael. Watching the two Sin Caras go at it at Hell in a Cell back in 2000. Great counter. He doesn't want to win this one outside the ring. Because he's a pro king, he wants to get it done inside. The shoulders are down. Oh, look at that. He managed to get a shoulder up. Well, like they say, Cole, timing is everything. Amazing. You just can't keep Sin Cara down for the count. Look at this. There is absolutely no wasted motion in this attack. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Uh-oh. Sin Cara appears to have been grounded, King. He needs to regroup. Adding insult to potential injury there. Uh-oh. Here we go. That's it. He's out. And here's a cover. And he breaks the cover, forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. What do you have to do to keep this guy down? Oh, out of nowhere! Folks, we're in Rosemont tonight, a city that has hosted several WrestleManias, including the second leg of WrestleMania 2. Oh, wait, nice reversal! Nearly driven through the mat. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. I've heard it from countless superstars over the years, including Stone Cold Steve Austin, that this arena in Rosemont is their favorite arena to compete in. It's all over but the shouting. You know, I don't know the names of half the moves Sin Cara's done, but I know I've loved every one of them. What an attack. The animosity levels of this match just continue to rise. Make no mistake about it. This is a war. This is an all-out war. Inside the ring again. Yeah, and they should be. This is where the action needs to be. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Keep the action inside the ring. That's where you're going to win this thing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's it. He's done. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. WWE fans watching this match all around the world. We want to say hi to them, all the countries, even Manila, where I use their envelope. Manila's not a country. See, Carl turns the tide. <laughs> it is absolutely dizzying how fast Sin Cara is. People have been wanting to see these guys go at it for a long time, and by the sound of this crowd, I think they're getting what they wanted. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken.
He's too good inside the ring to be out on the floor for long. I don't agree with you, King. This is a and will this be it? It may be. Two. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. I don't know how much more damage he can take. There can only be one top dog here in the WWE, and a win here will go a long way in solidifying one of these guys' claims of being the best in the business. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously rung there. From the top! To take a chance like that, do you know how badly he must want to win this? Look how slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. Gosh, the same move over and over. This is relentless. I am getting tired of watching this. Do something different. Man, he's still down after that move. No! Wow! Unbelievable impact there. He needs to dig way. Oh my gosh! How much more? How much more are you willing to pay to win this match? This is on. Oh, and he eats the canvas. Yeah, and now Green got it. But is it enough for Green to pick up the win? One, two, and the shoulders up in time. Well, as long as he's up before that three count, that's all that matters. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. The arm has become the focal point of this attack. Yeah, it's got a big red bullseye on it. We've seen this. And now Green got it. But is it enough for Green to pick up the win? His shoulders are down. Two. Three. What a huge win. You want to talk about incredible high-impact sports entertainment? Check out what happened during this match. Let's take a look back at what exactly happened during this one. through everything they had at each other in this match. Let's see what happened during that incredible matchup. Here's your winner. Extremely impressive win, guys. That was simply a case of one guy determined to prove his dominance over another. And I'll tell you, the roof nearly blew off this place in Rosemont when the bell finally rang to end this one. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. Accompanied by Bobby, the brain Heenan, from Robbinsdale, Minnesota, weighing 257.